Samson family, welcome back. The vlog today is just about my top 10 recommendation of Afro gospel artists you should listen to in 2024. You know I've talked about secular songs, Christian songs and the rest. But one thing that keeps repeating itself over and over again for a long time now is that most people complain that there are no good Christian songs they should use for their party. Uh, they will not go to their party and be playing Don Sinonyeka and uh, Nathaniel Balsi, GUC. And, though there are some messaging one songs that are good for parties, but they will still complain. Today I will be giving to you 10 good Afro gospel artists. Now before I start the list of these artists, let's do a little explanation of what Afro gospel is all about. Afro gospel is just Afro beats, Afro beat song, but having Jesus music, the music of the church infused into Afro beats. That's just what Afro gospel is all about. And one thing is Afro gospel is very broad and wide than the way we than the way we think it is. Now, most people will just feel it's just Afro beats. No, it's not just Afro beats. There are some songs that that have the ama piano vibes, but we cannot say ama gospel. I be ama piano gospel. I will go put and pass. So all those other parts, all those other ones that don't fall under, let's say, urban Christian music. They don't fall under uh, our regular praise and worship song. We pack all of them together and we put them inside one big basin. I will call it basin Afro gospel. With that being said, let's dive right into the 10 artists I'll be recommending for you to listen to in 2024 in no particular order. Now, the first person I'll be recommending is no other person than Obaringi. Now, most people don't, like a lot of people, a lot of you who will be watching these videos will be hearing of these names for the first time. But trust me, you, if you follow my recommendation, Go and check out these artists. You will come back here and thank me that Henry Sam said thank you for this recommendation because I've been looking for good Christian music that have these pom 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 vibes to it. The songs that we can play at our parties, the song that we can use for birthday celebration, the song that can turn up our wedding like Omo. Now the first person is Obaringi. I've known this guy for quite a long time now, but over this space of time that I've known him, he has never relented in giving us that good Christian music in a way that it has this feeling that you will love. I think he's the one or another person who I'll be recommending that has this uh, that has this slogan that let's make Jesus music, but let's make it pump, pump, let's make it vibe, let's make it trendy. Now, the first person I said is Obaringi. One of his songs that is my all-time favorite is Olowo Bogboro. Aside the logo, but I also like uh, Almost There. You can check out the other songs on Spotify, Boomplay, and the rest of the digital streaming platform. The second person I'll be recommending for you to listen to is the one and only altar boy, Double Williams. Now, this guy, he, he has a way of doing his music. I, I don't know how I'm going to classify him. He can bring in Afro beats, bring in Ama Piano, bring in Salsa, bringing the urban vibe and he will now put all of them inside one thing most times when people hear this song they'll be like nah this song is not a christian song because he's giving worldly vibes now if you listen to double williams you may even say he's a worldly artist but if you pay attention to the lyrics which is the core part of every song you know that he's a christian artist doing christian song but giving it that hype and that trendy feeling for you to listen to he has a lot of songs on digital stores but one of my favorite songs from this artist that i will recommend to you to check out if you want to check out the recommendation is wgcnd what god cannot do a hey, does not exist miracles go happen hey brother believe so i love that song very much now the third person i'll be talking about is no, not just talking about, I'll be recommending to you. It's not that person than Melody Man. I don't know. Most of you, so some of you who have not known these people, you may not, you may not be going well with the vibes I'm giving, the, 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 the attack I am bringing out. When you hear Melody Man in any song, we are talking about the one and only great man, Takit. Oh my, this guy is good. You not get any of his song when you go here, when... If you just sit down like this, now the song will play, you'll start with it, you pop your head small, small. Before you see, you know, they tap your feet. 
like people like question not to submit dance for where we sit down no more we don't give like 10 to 15 thousand different steps for our heads but if there's more we'll get up than a zero of a hundred <laughs> but then you check out great man tackets the next person is the lover boy angelo Omo. He does Afro gospel songs, so, but this guy, if you are single, please don't listen to some of his songs because you will be asking God, God, am I a spoon? Am I a Tony Gary stick? But irrespective of that, he's one of the Afro gospel artists that I am recommending to you. The next person I'll be recommending to you is Remas. Remy boy, boy, boy. He has been doing so, so, so well. But the funny fact now is this thing. Uh, Why we are talking about Afro gospel songs and Afro gospel artists recommending them to you? Rema's best song that I love so much is not an Afro gospel song. It's actually a Christian hip hop song. Been through. I don't look like what I've been through. Hey, mama told me that I come through. Yeah, yeah. I don't look like what I've been through. Forget the Christian hip hop part. And Remas is one good artist that you should listen to. Before I go ahead, I know many people will start to say, Pashada Day, Pashada Day. Since you have been mentioning men, you may not do Afro gospel. Or you have two ladies I recommend it to you. And these two ladies are close to my heart. Not that I have a personal connection with them, but now the first person I will recommend it to you is Same OG. And this lady has energy man when we talk of energy to sing this lady get power she did sing away well. over time now i've been listening to her new uh afro gospel jam that she has been putting out both personal both featured and you need to listen to this lady this 2024. the next lady i want to talk about is yo yo michael i got to know this lady it was true one song that the title of the song was jiri wajo majire Wajo Majiro again. Wajo Majire. The the stuff is this this lady has not just energy, not just vibe. She has this style in her. Sorry to other female artists out there. I'm not trying to put you below anybody, but um, if I listen to her, I'll be like Nadi, queen of Afro gospel be this. She has this energy and she's giving it out back to back. Now, the number eight person I'll be recommending to you is DJ Hofure. This guy is a disc jockey. And aside the DJ stuff that he does, this guy has good music. There was this particular song he put out, Dance Like David. I just want to dance like David today. Da, 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 da. Don't ask me what Tana Tana is. Go and listen to this song, Dance Like David by DJ Hofure. The next person I'll be recommending to you, his name is Spills Oshai. I actually got to know this guy. I think that was 2018 or 2019 when he released one love song. me love I'm a love the sweet child. That is a distraction. A story for another day. But you should actually also listen to Spills in 2024. Now, the number 10 I'll be talking about is no other person than Mycon West. Mycon West. Anyhow, you pronounce it, Mycon, Mycon. All of them are con, Agbado. Sorry, Mycon, Ajoko. <laughs> I actually love his music. I love the way he, he put out his, his stuff. I won't, I won't finish this, this vlog without mentioning his favorite song, like the song I love most for him. Ah, Michael, you will you will know this song, and I, I know you love this song too. Over the bar, issue over the bar, poverty over the bar, everything went not good over the bar. As we not agree for twenty twenty four, anything went not good too over the bar. You should also check out Michael West. Guys, those are my ten recommendations of Afro gospel artists you should pay attention, listen to in twenty twenty four. I'll be dropping a link to their Spotify account in the description section. Go there, look through this artist song and don't stream their song every now and then. But then, before I finish, before I say bye-bye to you before, I know some people will hold me by my neck and be like, how will you mention Afro Gospel artists and you will not mention Limo Blaze? 
How will you mention our gospel artists and you not mention Prince Emmanuel? God not go shame us. I beg. It's not that I don't want to mention them, but the stuff is this. These guys have already made a name for themselves. When you hear Afro gospel artists, I know you you would have been thinking of you want to hear Limo Blaze here, you want to hear Prince Emmanuel here. Now, the purpose of this particular vlog is to mention those who have not been heard like that to a newer audience. I'm not trying to say they are a new cats in the industry, but these people don't have the same level of fame like the limo blaze and prince emmanuel now aside the top 10 that i have listed there are still other artists that i can recommend that you should listen to afro gospel artists we have the like of t gods that flames peter we have the like of eel i don't know if that is the pronunciation we have the likes of poor rarity rarity put on the microphone we have a lot a lot a lot now i may not be able to remember everyone that is doing so well in the afro gospel industry at the moment but if you know anyone just drop their name in the comment section in the description i'll be looking through the comments and anyone i see i'll go to spotify copy their spotify link and add it to the description section 2024 will not agree for anybody and 2024 listen to this good afro gospel artist that make jesus music Pum, 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 with the vibes. This is me signing out. Until the next time, I remain Henry Samson. Peace out.